What's up guys? This is Fierce Pillow 9 with the Crossband Pulse R71 Airsoft Gun Shooting Test. Yep, this is a shooting test. It's the second part of the review, and if you haven't seen it, then you can go check it out on my channel. So what we'll be shooting today is this Reese's Puffs box. And I really much I really did enjoy these Reese's Puffs and I feel bad bad to shoot it, but I have no use for it. So yeah. What, how this thing's going to work is I'm going to do about 10 shots on semi-automatic from about 50 feet away and then about 15 shots on fully automatic from 50 feet away. And my gun at first for semi-automatic may get jammed. So when, when you hear something hit, then that's when you know it's working. So... Yeah, hopefully this camera does not fall over, and it stands perfectly. Uh, come on, come on. Okay, there! Okay, so... See what happened. Okay. See here. Um. Oh, here's one thing right there. I don't know if you can see it. Um. Huh. Another one right on top of the R. Made a little hole. Um. Oh, I don't know. It doesn't make that much. It doesn't do that much damage, but it's okay. It's kind of accurate, and in airsoft wars, you do not want to kill anybody. So, oh, a BB just got stuck in there. That's funny. So, in airsoft wars, you do not want to kill anybody. So, yeah, it's still pretty accurate. Now let's see how powerful the fully automatic is. Okay, camera, please do not flip over, and there we go. So, I'm going to shoot from 50 feet back, right about here. Okay, so let's get this going. Okay, so let's check this thing out. Okay, so let's see here. Um, it's, it's yeah, like I said before, doesn't really do that much damage to the box, but there's some holes in it. Okay, so the so the conclusion is this gun is accurate. It doesn't hurt, so that's good. And yeah, that's the end of the shooting test. So please rate, comment, and subscribe. I'm out.